As the 2023 election draws near, Islamic clerics have urged Muslims to take part in the electioneering process to vote credible leaders. This was said during the TVC Communications Muslim Community Ramadan Lecture for this year. Correspondent Adida Jassalam Adini reports. In Ramadan, fasting from dawn to dusk, which includes abstaining from drinking and eating, immoral acts and anger, and giving charity are not the only acts of worship, but coming together to study the Quran is also encouraged. Islam is more than a religion of personal pieties. Speaking on the theme, the role of Muslims in choosing beneficent leaders, Chief Imam Nasrullah Ilifati Society urged Muslims to shun the I don't care attitude in selecting their representatives come 2023 general election. Allah says, guide against that calamity. That when it wants to befall people, it will not befall only those who are unjust. When the problem wants to come, it will not select those who are unjust. We are part of a larger community. We cannot afford to be passive spectators. Allah says, cooperate with other. Fourth, participate in election. Ensure that there is security in your community. For some of us, even we are do security fee, we don't pay. Are we patient enough and hands unto Allah? Are we not hasting in choosing our leaders? Do we follow the moral step and involve Almighty Allah in the process? The chief imam of Modinotu Tijaniyat, Aladeketu, Sheikh Babatunde Yusuf Arikeuyo, who spoke in Yoruba language, spoke on the role of Muslims in enhancing national security and highlighted the impact of quality education and good parenting. And the Quran is the total way of life. The talk today made me realize you must learn the meaning too. Because by knowing the meaning of the Ali Quran, you'll be a better Muslim. With lectures like this, it is believed that the commitment of citizens to selecting leaders will have the heart of service instead of seeking immediate benefits will be improved.